Mm. I want to talk about our relationship with China. Mm -hmm. If you were to be president, how do you think about foreign policy, economic ties? We can't decouple, right? So how do you think about that relationship? So respectfully, I actually disagree with you on that. I think we have an opportunity to decouple from China. And here's the challenge. Even with Reagan and the USSR, we never relied on the Soviet Union for the shoes on our feet or the phones in our pockets. Today, we're reliant on our enemy for our modern way of life. Codependent relationships do not end well. The only question is who ends it first. And mm -hmm. I think the sooner we end it, the better for us. It's not as hard as we make it out to be. Because decoupling from China does not necessarily mean onshoring all of that to the U.S. Mm -hmm. We have Japan, South Korea, mm -hmm. India, Thailand, Philippines, Vietnam. Australia, Vietnam, even Brazil, other parts of the world. We make this out to be more difficult than it is. Mm. It will require preparedness to make some sacrifice. But I will sit across the table from Xi Jinping and I will tell him, we are prepared to go the distance of even banning most U.S. businesses from doing business in China unless you reform. No intellectual property theft, data theft. We're done with that. China's in a tougher spot than we are. They will fold if we actually have the fortitude to deliver that message. It's going to take an outsider to do it. It's a big part of why I'm in this.